Hello, Virgos. So, this is going to be for the month of July. Um, and just know that the energies can be reversed. So, if the messages aren't for you, they can also be for your cross watcher. This is beautiful. So, already it shows hold the vision and believe in the impossible. So hold the vision. I, I also heard like trust the process. So you're you're going through um, a transformation and spirit wants you to trust, trust the process. And I hear the energy is gaining momentum. So I feel like you can be starting something new. I hear the finishing touches. So you're finishing a, a project. It can also be, um, yeah, this is cute. This is like a, like a hobby, something very creative that you have started and you're, you're finishing up this project and you're really excited about it. It's like you're proud of yourself. Because I hear stepping out your comfort zone. You could have took a while to step out your comfort zone and, and try new things that are very, very creative. I hear seeing the world in a whole new light and pressing forward. Yeah, it's like you're going through so many changes and developing a lot of um, awareness, a lot of insight, a lot of awareness. So you can be highly empathic highly intuitive and for some of you I hear trying to rush through the process so you could have been trying to rush through your own life journey and it's like life could have slowed you down okay because there's so much to learn through the process there's so much growth that occurs just from going through the process All right. so let's see what is at the center? For some of you, you could have put an end to a past relationship or past friendships. It's like literally like declaring to start brand new, <laughs> like everything, like getting rid of everything and um, starting all over. For some of you, I hear the word soul tribe. So you have a soul tribe or you're trying to put your place, put yourself in a place where you're connected with your soul tribe. So it's like people fuel, people who stimulate you and nurture your growth, inspiring changes, healthy developments. A lot of the things that you're doing will be the center of attention. Um, or and also like the center of your focus right now like the center of your focus is all about growth and mastering one's ability it can even be you trying to master yourself for some of you I hear the word artist I hear artist and bookings okay so let's see yeah so there could have been an obstacle to a brand new beginning in love for you, or you're finding it, you're finding obstacles and challenges to um, start over new in love. For some of you, it could be the beginning of a relationship and you're starting to find it challenging for things to take off with this particular person. And for others of you, it's almost like you're trying to start over new, brand new in love, like wanting to attract a different type of person and you're finding it challenging to do so. Let's see, what's ahead? I did say that, that's the first thing I said. It's like you're, you're going through a transformation Yeah, this is wish fulfillment. I just said that, like wanting to attract something brand new. 
I just I just said that and that's exactly what it is. Like you're going through a transformation in, in your wish fulfillment. Um, for some of you, I hear a new diet. You're having a brand new freaking world, like literally a new diet. Like you have a new diet for your choice of people. Um, and that's that's in friends. I hear coworkers. <laughs> it's like a, a brand new transformation that's that's occurring on the inside, the internal that's going to change your external world. It's beautiful. For some of you, you can be at a crossroads. Why? Oh, this is a crossroad and this, this could be with um, communicating or traveling and moving. For some of you, you could be at a crossroads on where to move. Maybe some of you guys are relocating. For others of you, maybe you want a brand new beginning with, with someone else. I don't know why I said with someone else. <laughs> um, there could be someone that you possibly see as wish fulfillment and you're at the crossroads on whether you should reach out to them or whether you should keep it moving. So that's also a possibility. Another thing that's gonna come to you, I hear a spike in income. So you're gonna you're gonna notice um, an increase in your in your salary. You're getting a salary increase for many of you Virgos. When I was meditating on your sign, I heard um, prosperity. So there's lots of, of I hear even finding new ways to make money. I hear multi-million dollar companies. Some of you guys can be changing companies, elevating, developing new skills and growing, growing in your business too. So let's see what the past, recognition and reward. Yeah, you see, you were resting on, you took a break. It's like you shift the focus, Virgos. Maybe you found love love very challenging to you so you took a break on it but even though you took a break and you're starting to work on your abundance like your prosperity and all your business ventures you're at a crossroad you still keep pondering or thinking about this person in the midst of your transformation so you took a break from them took a break but you still haven't fully you haven't completely walked away I hear isolated. You're right. You're all by yourself right now. You just needed time. Yeah. You took a break from them because you felt like they weren't fulfilling your needs. Like things weren't manifesting in this relationship the way that you were hoping for. Yeah. And there's something to do with communication. There's something to do with communication. You could have communicated this to this person that, you know, things things are not working out the way that I was hoping it would. So I'm gonna I'm gonna put things to an end. That's what it sounds like. That's exactly what it is. It was it was lots of challenges um, and obstacles in developing this relationship with this person and you had to communicate to them and say like, hey, I can't do this right now anymore, you know? But even though you took a break from this person, it's like you haven't you haven't walked away. So, and when I see the water, to me, it's like you, there's still, I hear longing. <laughs> you still can be longing for this person or this person still can be longing for you. Okay, so this is in the past. And even though you're striding and you're moving forward, because I like that. It's like you're you're moving forward. This is why spirit is probably telling you to believe in the impossible. Because maybe you feel that the, the type of love that you want could pos is feels like it's impossible. Because of all this, because of all these challenges. And this is why spirit is telling you to hold your vision of love. You could be feeling really discouraged right now. And you don't know if 
you should completely give up on somebody or if you should reach out to them one more tr one more time before you completely throw in the towel. That's what it looks like. All right, let's see what's in your current position, Virgo. Oof. Yeah, this is heartache and loss. So you're sad. Like, you're sad without them. Like, it hurts that... I hear growth. Like, you really wanted things to grow. You really could have seen them as wish fulfillment, and you've seen the future with this person. I hear hypnotized. <laughs> That's how you could have felt when you've seen them. They could have been... Like their structure, they could have been perfect externally on the external parts of them. They could, they could have externally represented everything that you wanted in a partner, but it could have been the internal parts of them that affected this connection. Okay, so let's see more about this heartache and loss. I hear a fountain of youth. Many of you, you look young. <laughs> aging very gracefully for some of you aging backwards so you look young but you could be very wise and very mature all right so heartache and loss yeah like you you want fairness this is in your current position justice for some of you you guys can work with work in the field of criminal and law I just got that too. And maybe I keep hearing the same thing. <laughs> Let me tell y'all, y'all Virgo something. I, I keep hearing a, a increase in your finances, like a, a pay raise, a, a promotion. I hear a substantial amount. Like you're about to, you're about to be loaded, baby. Money is about to be looking sweet. Um, but yeah, some of you can work with the courts, okay? Clarify justice. And for others of you, fairness is coming to you um, in love. Yeah, there's going to be someone who, um, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm laughing because I heard like posed as a threat. So, so maybe you felt like this person was threatening your peace. That's what I hear. Like they were posing a threat to your peace. And this is why you had to, I hear gathering information. You could be trying to gather information and insight on this person. You can be trying to keep them in your sight to make sure like what I feel about them. Is it true or is it not? Like you're still trying to figure this person out. It's like one foot in the door and one foot out. But I see that justice is going to come to you. I hear the emperor, like, taking charge. So someone, I hear, lacked boundaries. I don't know if it was you or them in the past. Someone who lacked boundaries or someone who you felt was crossing your boundaries. is going to come back. I hear fully charged, Virgos. They're coming back fully charged. Yeah. <laughs> come back fully charged and this is this is a soulmate so this is a soulmate you have a very strong soul connection with this person i hear can't take my my hands or my eyes off of you even if i wanted to so if you are kind of stuck on this person they're going through the same thing too and i hear like deviating this person could have went back to their old ways of being and that's what caused the separation i don't know if i said that before i feel i feel like i'm repeating myself but the spirit is is communicating the same thing over and over again um yeah things were things were really imbalanced in the past things were very imbalanced in the past between you and this person all right so let's see what is coming in the near future. Ooh. This is this is beautiful. A firm foundation. Um Virgo, somebody has their eye on you. Somebody has their eye on you. Somebody has an eye on you. Like they're watching you. 
someone who you felt was like reluctant to change their ways and this is what i'm trying to say i don't i don't think you believe in this person i feel like you don't you don't believe that it's possible for them to change um but they're trying on like they're trying to keep up with you on the low so they might be watching you i guess watching to see what you're up to what is your next move seeing what you're doing in your personal life i hear like a game um they could have looked at you as a very ambitious person or a very inspirational person and <laughs> that lives their life on the edge so that's kind of dope you're ambitious you work really hard but then you have this edge side that you like to go out and you like to be adventurous this person i hear it like craved craved excitement or craved you because they found you exciting um but they had some ways about them that you wasn't feeling you wasn't feeling it all right so clarify yeah this is the star so I hear like divine intervention in the near future to help you create a firm foundation. Once again, for some reason, I feel like this foundation can be with your own stability. Um, your own stability. I hear next to, okay, whoever this person is, it's like, Okay, these cards fell out. Let me see let me see what this is all about. Who whoever this person is, I think it's so hard for them to keep up with you. So I hear the word distractors. Like they could they could at times um go back to old ways. Maybe they have issues with self-esteem or feeling like they're enough for you. This could be something that they're struggling with behind the scenes that you're unaware of. This is a lot. These just flew out, so I said I'm going to take them. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You you felt that there, there was something about this person that they just seemed very, like, awakening to their ways. Like, you felt like they were a source of drama. You felt like they were a source of drama. And I hear therapeutic. Like, you wanted to balance yourself back out. You needed, um, for some of you, I hear therapy. Some of you guys can be getting therapy. Like, really trying to balance yourself out and and i hear lead with love this is so damn pretty i like this oh my god this this sounds so powerful like you want to lead with love and you're you're seeking the help that you need i hear closure to your past like you're trying to find closure with your past in order to move on forward okay and and you're digging deep in your roots too by the way like you're you're on a soul search like trying to dig deep find out who you are what people what powerful people were connected to you trying to understand yourself on a soul level um i hear committed to change you are committed to change like you're you're really big people might call you a perfectionist and you're like no honey i am um a person who who strives for excellence. See, I just want to be the best version of myself. Okay, because I hear abundant. People look at you as being very abundant. Okay, and once again, this can be for you or this can be for the cross watcher. Please be aware of that. So yeah, it's like you release them. You release them. <laughs> And there's something that you're trying to put to an end. There's some type of change, something that needs to, to die and fall that hasn't. Okay, so I hear in review, in, introspection. You could be thinking a lot. You're trying to put, it could be the past. You're trying to leave your past in the past. You have to drop this person to continue to work on yourself. Yeah. Yeah, look, this person could have caused you a lot of heartbreak or you felt heartbroken by them, but it's not over. It's a cycle that you, you were trying to close out that is not, it's not. And it shows Ace of Pentacles. So that's like a, a there we go. This is what you've been, this is what you've been wanting. A firm foundation. 
This is divine intervention helping you achieve this firm foundation that you want. Um, let me see. Okay. Outside. <laughs> Your outside influence. I just said that. It's like moving in a positive direction. I'm so, pr I'm so proud of y'all. Can you see this? Like the boat sailing. You're trying to sail away from the bullshit. <laughs> this is why the energy is gaining momentum. You're creating your best life, and I like this. See, there's a brand new beginning coming towards you, Virgos. I really love this. Let's continue on with the extended. I send you so much love and light. We're going to go into this new beginning and also this person that you were dealing with, okay? I send you so much love and light. <laughs> 